Henry VIII by Airfix. Coming up next on Monster Hobbies, what's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Slescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, today we're going to turn to the pages of history and to the royal family as we open up this box of Henry VIII by Airfix. So without further ado, lords and ladies, let us go down to our table and take a look at the plastic. And now we're going to look at some royalty with Airfix's Henry VIII model kit. 112 scale, so he's a little bit smaller than our other figures. But still just as cool. And this is the kind of box that opens from the top. So we'll just knock the contents out. I do believe that this kit was introduced originally in the 1960s by Airfix. It's one of the more interesting kits that you'll find because it's a historical kit, but it's kind of odd too. Odd subject matter. But then again, Airfix is an English company, so maybe it's not so odd across the seas. But as you can see, it's quite simple to put together. Like most figures, they're pretty easy. The fun is in actual painting of the figure, because all this is gold and wool and other interesting colors. Royalty of the time period. So now let's take a look inside and see how this model is. So we got our bag of fun here and our Boy Scout hobby knife, pocket knife, sorry, from the 80s. And Henry is molded in this nice gray plastic. And there we have his chest and torso piece. <laughs> the big cod piece that was quite uh, popular back in that time. Oh my. Uh, okay, so there we have his sword, or little dagger. Actually, more than a dagger, but anyway, there's the base where he would stand, part of it. No, that's the bottom of his, for his legs. There's the base where he stands. There we have his hat and one of his legs and the bottom of his shoes. And then here we have his majesty's face and his hat, the top piece of his hat, as well as his arms, hand holding a royal scroll or something. And there is his rosary go around his neck. You can see it's quite a nice detailed kit. Um, not sure what that is. Probably one of his legs or arms. And then there is the back of his cape. So this would be a very fun model to build. There's some more detail parts. Probably like shoulder pads or something. And that concludes our look at the Henry VIII kit by Airfix. Well, we hope you enjoyed this review of Henry VIII, the Airfix model. And if you would like to see what other kind of figure model kits we have, please check out our website down below, www.monster-hobbies.ca. And if you'd like to see some of the other figures and TV stuff that we have reviewed, please click here and here. And if you would like to see how we do a monster model contest, please click over here. And don't forget to like and subscribe to us down here. And please go on my homepage and make a donation so I can continue making these videos using my PayPal button. And until next time, keep building.